These six red dots aren't supposed to exist, but nearly hidden deep in one of the James Webb Space Telescope's first images, they're starting to reveal their secrets. They might be whole galaxies as large and mature as our own Milky Way. But that's a surprise, because they're being seen shortly after the dawn of the universe, and they should be much smaller and simpler. The first galaxies began in pools of a mysterious substance, dark matter. We know how these dark matter clumps form. We know that normal matter should follow them. We know the ratio at which dark matter and normal matter exists is part of our standard model. Um, and these galaxies seem to have too much normal matter. Too much matter, or just stuff, means the earliest stars in our universe were heavier than expected and developed sooner than expected, possibly containing some elements essential for life. Webb's ability to see new frequencies of light opened up new areas of investigation. Now, the findings will challenge models of how stars were born. I expect when the dust settles, when we get follow-up observations, when we get more, when we get better data, we will, we will probably find that cosmology is the same and that uh, there's something else going on in these systems that we don't understand, some combination of stars forming really early, galaxies forming way faster than we expected, um, and maybe some uh, exotic physics that, that aren't currently in our current models. Even if each is a galaxy like our own, all we can see are 20 or 30 pixels in the darkness, just enough to imagine worlds. It's sort of a crazy thing. Colin Baker, Al Jazeera.